Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I should be sleeping right now. Uh, <laughs> it's Sunday, July 14th. It's 1.37 p.m. And I've been doing comments. I've had all the negativity I can stand. A lot were deleted. Some were blocked. Look, y'all don't come on my channel trying to tell me whatever and negativity, you're just going to get erased or blocked even. Let's just pretend that on the 17th, it's not the rapture, but it's someone going to blow up America, which I know it's not. Let's just say that's what it is. Are you ready to die? You. Yeah, you. Ergo, May. And all the rest of you putting all the negativity, shame somebody, Caldera, and some others. Look, are you ready to die? You better be, because you might be right. What if you were right? What if we are wrong? What if we are wrong? And 717 is coming from the enemy somehow. He's getting through. My wall of Holy Spirit fire, the warrior angels, the blood of the lamb on the outside of this building, the blood of the lamb on the inside of the building, the blood of the lamb times three on my body, and the blood of the lamb applied to my helmet of salvation. The enemy's getting through and giving me lies and all these other people. Who are getting confirmations, dreams, messages, and visions. Let's just say the enemy was that clever. And he put all those blood moons up in the sky on the feast days. Let's say that God allowed the enemy to do that. And you're right. And we're wrong. All you naysayers. Uh, this is for you. If you are truly born again, you love God with all your heart, mind, soul, and with all your strength, and you love your neighbors as yourself, I should think you would just shut your mouth and pray for us. And ask the Holy Spirit to reveal his truth to us. And pray for your own selves to be ready. Because on the same day of the rapture is coming destruction. And you ain't making it. I'm sorry. I, and to put it that way, it's people with that kind of attitude will not make it. Okay? You won't. I believe that the Lord is separating the foolish virgins from the wise. And he's watching. Don't think he's not reading every word that you're putting on our channels. Every word. Or if you're blocked, he knows your thoughts that you wish you could put. Oh, I'm blocked. I wish I could say this is all such a bunch of bully. Hooey. Whatever word you would use. You know, if we were still here on the 18th, all of us are going to need a lot of prayer. Because we are fully trusting in the Lord our God. The signs he gave us in the sky. The revelations he gave to our sisters. Yeah, some of us, we get lied to with a message here and there. Or a dream that we think is from God. It's not really. But, you know, we're, we're just human. We're not perfect. I don't believe for a minute that all these revelations that people are getting are from 
a lying source. I just find that real hard to believe. I know Satan's really smart. I know he was right up there with God at one time. Pick your side. If you don't believe in dates, okay, you don't believe people should set dates. I get it. I did one time. I followed Cat T. I said, everybody, I know for sure the rapture is going to be September the 2nd. Whatever the day was, September 2nd or 3rd, 2015, I think. I think that was the year. Other than that, all I've said was high rapture watch dates based on what these other people were getting. And I never said it was for sure a date just to watch out, be ready, keep trying to save people. Keep working, keep doing your, you know, spreading the good news. And I just wanted to come on here and say that. If that were to happen, that we were still left. And here's another thing. I still think it could be possible that it could be a day or two off. I don't know how. I don't know how that would be possible. But we don't know the mind of God. This I do know. I fear him more than I fear any of you. And he seems to have given us a day. And our father can do whatever he wants to. And that verse that no man knows the day or the hour, written 2,000 years ago, was a present tense. And I keep telling people this. It does not say no man will ever know the day or the hour. Or we don't know the hour. You might could figure it out by the time zone map. If we're all going to be taken on 717, you might be able to figure out the hour. Let's see what if the Lord doesn't go by that. And why do I keep going dark and light? That's weird. Okay, whatever. My cursor, no, my cursor had nothing to do with it. But y'all, let's stay encouraged. If you've read any of these negative comments, you stay encouraged. And let's keep looking up. Because our redemption draws nigh. Our Jesus is coming. I don't think we've been lied to. I'm 99.9% .9 sure. And I'd like to say 100%. But I do know the enemy is something else. And he causes confusion wherever he can. But I also know our father is greater than he. He, our enemy. Greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. And if Father wants to let his son come and get his bride on the 17th, you really think he's not going to tell us? That's okay. Just be ready. Okay? Be ready. Repent and be ready. With that, I plead the blood of Jesus over this video and the internet connection and over each and every one of you as well. I forgive all you naysayers. I understand where you're coming from, but you're not acting very good. All right? You need to repent. That's all I have to say about that. Okay. Bye for now. I'll talk to you later.